Merhaba and hoş geldiniz. Welcome to the Magical Red Bikini channel. My name is Becky. Thank you so much for stopping by. I appreciate you being here more than you can possibly know. Um, today I have my, I'm showing off my pin boards. Two of my pin boards because this is going to be a two-parter. Because this is going to be way too long otherwise. So we're going to start off with my smallest pin board first, which is my Star Wars pin board. Uh, most of this is Disney park pin. Most of these are Disney park pins. Some of them are box lunch. And I do have one small shop pin and unfortunately I bought it like in 2020 and I don't have the information of where I, I, I don't remember the shop's name that I bought it from anymore. So I'm super sorry. In the future, if I buy anything off of Etsy, I will have it linked down below so that you can see where it came from. I can't, all I can tell you is that I got it off of Etsy, but I don't remember the shop and I am so, so sorry about that. Um, but this was before I was as big independent as, as I am now. So please forgive me for that. I'm sorry in advance to the person who I purchased this beautiful print from. I love it. So I'm going to show you two of my pin boards today. My, start, my small, my two smaller ones. Also, I have Halloween pins on another pin board. So I'm going to show that one a little bit later because it'll be more festive and fun for, to show in Halloween. Sometime in October. So, we're going to wait on that one. So, let's go ahead and get started with my Star Wars pins, okay? All right. So, I was born in July, so I'm a Cancer. Um, and this is the first time I've seen on a pin a character that I was, like, super excited for my birthday about. So, like, I had to get Chewbacca. So, there's this one is the original. Um, so, Chewbacca is the Cancer pin for this pin set. There's the whole Star Wars set of this. You can, I found these off of your WDW store. And then also there's the chase for it. So there's like this pin that has like the zodiac sign and then it says protective and sensitive. Yeah, protective and sensitive. So that's super me. Um, also, I'm a Hufflepuff so for Harry Potter. Very, very fitting. So anyway, we'll go ahead and go down. So this I got from Galaxy's Edge. It's a cool Millennium Falcon pin. This pin I also got from Galaxy's Edge. This is the pin that you get. You can get four pins. You pay for you pay for the pins as you get your lightsaber. So I got this from Sabi's Workshop as well. This is the Elemental Nature pin that you get. This is a cake Millennium Falcon pin that I got from Box Lunch. This came out this year. There's a set. Um, this is the Jedi Knight set. There's also a Dark Side set. This is a cool set that of Star Wars, Jet Fighters, Jet Fighters, I don't know. Anyways, there's a set, a pin, a set of pins that my brother and my mother also all got, and this came from that set. Um, I'll leave that information linked down below if you're curious about it. Don't know when I became obsessed with Stormtroopers. It kind of like snuck up on me. All of a sudden I was like, Stormtroopers are the best, most amazing thing ever. So a lot of these are Stormtrooper pins. This is a whole, I think this is a mystery set as well. Um, this is the only one I have of this set. This is a gorgeous water ocean pin set from, of the Rebel sign. Came out last year, I think, or for when Rise of this, the Rise of Skywalker, I think. Maybe it's a Rise of Skywalker pin. But it's a super cool pin. It's got ocean and wave elements, which I think is really stunning. Plus it's blue for the Rebels. Um... This set, I had, I ended up with this one first and then I got these later on, but this is like a whole set. You've got Vader, Boba Fett, and Stormtrooper, and I love, I love those sets. That's a really gorgeous set. Um, it's got beautiful filigree on, work on it, all of them, so. Love that set. Uh, also, huge Baby Yoda fan. Obsessed with him, Baby Yoda, like the rest of America. <laughs> Um, so I've got this cute little park, Disney key, with Baby Yoda on it. It says Star Wars right there on the teeth of the key. Um, fighter pilot, um, Stormtrooper pin. It's funny because it says Pew Pew on there. And that's, that crack, pin cracked me up and I had to have it. Uh, Boba Fett was fun. So I got that one. Love the TV show. 
Although it was only like half Boba Fett, and then it was like back to Mando, which was kind of satisfying, but not at the same time. <laughs> um, so Star Wars Day, I've got a couple of Star Wars Day pins. I've got this one. This is from 2021. I had to get the Grogu pin, obviously. Where I go, he goes. These are box lunch pins. Super fun. No, oh, that's a Disney pin. Sorry, that's a Disney pin. Where I go, he goes. I love that pin. I think this is one of the last pins I got from my Disney store. Um, got this set for Christmas. I think it was these. Yeah, it was all three of these pins. And this one's a pin on pin. This one's stunning. It's got a glitter element. It's when they first meet. Um, Grogu and Mando. And then Grogu and his pram. And then just a really cool thing. This is the, um... Etsy pin from the shop that I can't remember. I'm so, so sorry. Um, we've got these. This is the other pin from that set. It's super glittery. This So you got the Jedi and then the Sith Lord. Um, a red execution. I can't remember if this is an executioner or just like... I don't know who that character is. I can't remember. Sorry. Cool Sith pin. Um, Darth Maul. He's super cool. Um, I've been struggling. I can't remember what this is. Let me know what this is down in the comments. But this is what... This is a box lunch pin that I got from my mother. Because she collected the set. And she had extra... Or she tried to collect the set. But she don't think she finished it. But this was an extra pin that she got. She gave it to me very nicely. Um, and then you got IG-11. Who's super cool. Love the nurse droid. This is the 2022 May the 4th Be With May the 4th pin. I had to get it because I had Grogu on it and he's super cute. And then Grogu using the Force. So that is my Star Wars pin set. I know that that's super rushed and super awkward, so I apologize for that. Um, but that's my Star Wars pin set. Or my pin board. So next we're going to move on to just my regular Disney slash... Um, stitch pin board so this is a bunch of random stuff that's on here um, some of these came from Magic Launch Bay which I got from I, I got that as a oh man my mind is blanking that was an advent calendar Man, I'm struggling today. I'm sorry. This was an ad so it was a Magic Launch Bake Advent Calendar. So I ordered this. Um, super fun to order. You say I like. I don't like. I think you. The only option was just to say what you didn't want, and I was like, no Snow White pins. Um, not a big Alice fan. I did get an Alice pin, but this is a really cool pin, so I'm not. I'm okay with it. Um, but these are all. Pins all come from either Paris or Hong Kong or Tokyo, Japan, or like the Tokyo, is it Tokyo? The Japanese Disneyland. I am struggling. I'm sorry. It's, it is what it is at this point. Okay, let's move on. So, uh, if you are curious about where any of these pins are from, let me know in the comments and I will respond to you. Or shoot, hit me up on Instagram at MagicalRebicKeyMe. MagicalRebicKeyMe. It's all one word. Um, I'll leave it link. I'll leave it down in the description below so you can easily find it. Um, anyways, let's go to this pin board. So this did come from Magic Launch Bay. So this is a foreign pin. And it's the cute pin of Tramp as a puppy, baby puppy in a blanket. This is um, a box launch pin of Scuttle. This is a Disney Park pin. Super cute. Yellow is my favorite color. So Pascal and yellow had to get. This came from a Wishes candle that I got from my Bibbidi box. This is my only wishes candle pin, and these are fun because it always comes with like a Disney Park pin. And I think that's it's either Prince Florian from Snow White or Prince Philip from Sleeping Beauty. I'm not sure 
100% which it is because it could be literally either one. I want to say it's Prince Philip because I want it to be Prince Philip that badly because he's my one of my favorite princes, but not 100% sure. This is a cool cocoa pin that also came from Magic Launch Bay. This came from Hong Kong. Uh, it has Hector and Miguel playing music together on it. Um, then I've got the super cool, I don't know who that character is. I don't think it's Angel because she's not pink, but it could be Angel. If you know who this character is, let me know in the comments down below. And then Stitch. This was also a Magic Launch Bay pin set, pin that came through. Kermy on Toast. This is a super, super cute pin. This is my only Muppets pin. Um, but it's fun, and it's Kermit and his Muppets, so I can't go wrong. So let's move on since we just did Stitch and even though I randomly went up to show Kermit, we're going to go on to Stitch. So this is Box Lunch Stitch playing a ukulele, Stitch playing in the sand, Stitch having some dinner, some dumplings or something Asian related. I'm not sure what, exactly what that food that is. Stitch with a duck on his head. These are all Box Lunch pins. Stitch reading... The ugly duckling to some ducks, which is super cute. Stitch guiding the turtle, the tortoise back into the water. Stitch from Stitch Crashes Disney, the Stitch Crashes Disney set. Uh, again, Sleeping Beauty is my favorite. So my brother bought me this pin for Christmas last year. And this is a cute rubberized elephant. This is the cake. It looks It's reminiscent of the cake, but also her dress of the make it pink, make it blue. I'm team blue for Aurora. Sorry, guys. Pink is not my favorite color. <laughs> but, um, yeah, I love this pin. And it was weird because Aurora is my favorite princess, but she's always in pink. I don't know. Anyways, um, cute little spring stitch pin. This is a stitch 20th anniversary pin because the 20th anniversary of stitch is this year. You got Lilo and Nani. Nani and Stitch. Super fun pin. Stitch current mood pin. This pin cracked me up because I feel like it's my mood a lot of the time when he's pulling his eyelids down. Uh, I bought that off of eBay. and I love that pin. It's hilarious. Um, and then you got another Stitch pin with um, Lilo and Scrump and Stitch playing in the sand. And that is the Stitch collection. Yay! All right, so moving on, we've got some mini pins. This is a pin on pin. This came, these came out last year, and then mini with Figaro on top of her head, super cute. This is a Magic Launch Bay pin, Magic Launch Bay pin. So this is mini, and then a super cool Aladdin pin. And so you've got Genie in the center, Jasmine right here, some gold and Abu, and they're in the Cave of Wonder. So that's a fun pin. This is a gorgeous pin. It's kind of like stained glass. This blue part is stained glass. You got Thumper. This is from Hong Kong Disney. Um, and this is Disneyland Paris pin. This is the Alice pin. Like I said, I'm not a big fat, fan of Alice, but this Mad Hatter pin is stunning. There's like a little green gem on there. It's a really beautiful pin, so I had to keep it. Um... This came from, this is Cricket from Mulan, or Cricky, Cricky from Mulan. It says Cricky on there, sorry. Um, that came in a blind box from Box Lunch in a Bibbidi box. This ham pin is also a Box Lunch, or a Box Lunch, Magic Launch Bay um, 2019 pin. Ham on there. Um... This is also a Magic Launch Bay pin for the... Oh, man. My mind is blanking. The guy from Zootopia. The fox. Anyway. It's not coming. If you know, let me know in the comments below. Okay. So, this set... This train came out with their Rip Mickey's Runaway Railway. So, you've got the engine. And I ended up getting just these three pins to go with it. You've got Mickey... Pluto and Daisy, um, super cute set, and it all links together to make this really gorgeous, gorgeous set. Okay, 
So from here, it's the fortieth anniversary of Pete's drag forty fifth anniversary of Pete's Dragon. So we've got Elliot in front of the lighthouse. Super cute pin. I'm I love Pete's Dragon. That was one of my favorite movies as a kid. So yeah, that holds a place near and dear to my heart. This is also a sketch these are both sketchbook ornament pin, sketchbook pins. Um, this is the 40th anniversary. This is the 30th anniversary. You've got Aladdin and Abu in front of the Cave of Wonders. It's a stunning, stunning pin. So those are new this year from the parks. And this 50th anniversary pin of Chip and Dale came in a bibbity box that I got recently. Super cute pin. Chip and Dale are some of my heroes. So I love Chip and Dale. They're so cute. This came in a bibbity box as well. It's a blind box. This is the only one I have from this set. And it's Sebastian reading Little Mermaid. So it's the sidekicks reading the books. And then this set right here. Uh, okay. This set right here is... I got this set for one pin. One pin alone. I love Timon's face. Because he's freaking out. This is when he's dancing the hula. In front of the hyenas. And he's not happy about it. But it's... Like the funniest scene in that whole movie. Um, but this whole, all these four pins came with this whole set. So you've also got Sebastian, Iago, and Lumiere, and they're all dancing. Um, very fun set. Um, this is the attraction pin set that is com coming out this year. So they have like a new pin every month. Um, but the Pirates one was my favorite and the other one that I really liked. So that's the one that I got. And it was massive. It's like the size of my hand. Uh, Bernard and Miss Bianca, another rescuer's sketchbook pin. Um, fine and dandy, you've got my girls, Minnie and Daisy. This was a super cute pin. I had to get it. Um, just It just spoke to my heart, so I, I bought it. And then up here, you've got three prince. Well, yeah, three princes and then Gaston. So you've got Beast, Gaston, Hercules, and Aladdin. And they're in a boy band, so they're all singing. Um, I got this pin set because of... Well, I love all these guys, but Aladdin's probably my favorite prince. Um, at least for right now. He's my favorite prince. So I had to get this whole set because it's it cracks me up because they're all singing and they're in a boy band. Nick Wilde. I remembered. Yay, Nick Wilde. Okay. Sorry. Okay. Uh, this came... From Magic Launch Bay. Um, it's a cute little Eeyore with some popcorn. Pascal. Not sure if this is from Soul or from... I don't remember. It's just a cute cat. And I feel like he came from Soul. That's probably my favorite scene in Soul. I didn't really like love the movie Soul, but I love the cat. Um, that was funny. So we've got an Earth Day pin with... The girl whose heart was stolen from Moana. That was a beautiful pin. Got that. This one is also from Magic Launch Bay. It's the coolest pin. It is a Monsters Inc. pin. You've got Sully on the other side of this yellow door. I can't see what I'm doing right now. Sorry. So, yep. And then it says... Oh, Pin Trading Nights 2018. So... Yeah, it's a super cool set. I like the spinning element, and it glows in the dark, and Sully's adorable in it. So, yay for that one. Um, and then this, I bought this one from Box Lunch. So this was another blind box set. And then we've got Cogsworth in a teacup. Um, this these both came from the same set of. Um, mother and child, so it's super cute. So you've got Dumbo and Mrs. Jumbo, and I love those two. I love elements, elephants, elements. I like elements too, but I like elephants. So uh, I love those guys. And then Chip and Mrs. Potts, um, Mickey icon pin with the flag. Up is another one of my favorite movies. So you've got Doug, and he's got a, it's a squirrel on the bottom. Crack me up. This was the pin that probably got me into collecting pins. 
we were at the parks and I did not get this pin because I wasn't super into pin trading at the time and then um, but I fell in love with this pin and I bought it later that same year but it was like months later because we were at the park in September and I think I got this in like February or December or January of the following year um but I love this up pin and it's got marbles for the house so you've got this little pink pin here that so, and then a pin down here and it anyways I love that pin it's one of my favorites sorcerer mickey is my favorite mickey I love this park this pin was adorable or it reminds me of the parks and the mickey balloons super cute so you got the castle down here and then you've got balloons above patriotic castle 50th anniversary castle super close was very iridescent and very 50th anniversary so it was super fun you got a duffy pin Maleficent pin. She came in a box lunch blind box. This one wasn't like an open pin, but it came from box lunch as well. This came from Magic Launch Bay. Um, Magic Launch Bay. And I think that's it. Yep, that's that whole pin board. So that or the that are those were her words. So the Star Wars pin board and the Disney pin board, kind of eclectic taste. They're both super random. No, they're not super random. I am struggling today. So I'm going to end it here. I will complete, I'll show you the next, my ear itches. Sorry, guys. I don't edit very well, so this is not going to be edited. <laughs> Sorry. But, um... I will come out with another pin board, my last pin board for you guys, um, uh, with my princess slash Halloween board set at a later date, probably next month. So anyways, those are my two pin boards and ha uh, probably about half my pins. <laughs> so I will see you guys, see you guys next time. Gouda shooters, thanks for stopping by. What was your favorite pin before I leave? Sorry, before I leave, what was your favorite pin? Leave it a comment down below. If you don't have a favorite pin of mine, that's fine. What was your, what is your favorite pin that you have? Or, yeah, what, what's in your collection? Let me know. Uh, until next time, see you guys, Scooter Shooters.